the volume of our household waste in some districts and markets of Cameroon's economic capital Douala worried and people are sounding the alarm bells. Africa mourns its idol, the king of the Coupe de Calais, Gigi Arafat, was buried Saturday, August 31st, after a big vigil show at the Ufet Wanu Stadium. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. In Cameroon, thousands of children from kindergarten to secondary school returned to school on Monday, September 2, 2019. It was the start of the school year and the first lesson were given. To ensure that the start of the school year is effective, the governor of the coastal region, Jodone Ivaha Ibua, has made a tour of school of some schools. The volume of our household waste in some districts and markets of Cameroon's capital economic dweller worried and people are sounding the alarm bells. Douala, the economic capital of Cameroon, which is home to more than 3.5 million inhabitants, is overwhelmed by the weight of, his, of this waste. We find garbage being full to the point where people have no choice but to throw the garbage on the ground. When you walk through the city, you realize that there is household waste that at some point clogs the roadway. Residents have great difficulty breathing because of the nauseating odors. Fact that also worsens in the rainy season turns into sticky mood. We are free to live here because it is the grace of God that makes us live. We can be comfortable living in the person's trash can. Not at all, not at all. I don't feel comfortable. I don't know if the delegate of the mayor could try to experience what we are going through here through this garbage modest. There are flies, mosquitoes, disease, smelly smells. I don't know if we put a bin like that near the delegate's house or the mayor's house. I'd like to see how he will react to that. There are many diseases that are linked to insalubrity. You have cholera during the rainy season, so you have smells, you have flies, you have small rodents that are vectors of many diseases like cholera, typhoid, chalky, so on and so on. The incivility of some people who throw garbage on the ground or prefer to send small children who are not the height of the bin drop the garbage on board. Neighborhood residents find no other solution than to burn this garbage and this will create huge hair pollution and also damage the garbage bins. The situation is not different in the city's market where the phenomenon does not attract the attention of traders who set up their stalls and tables all around and sometimes on the ground, who eat, laugh and chat in front of these piles of rubbish as well as these gendarmes and sparrow birds who also find their foods. We try to throw in the bin as best we can. When we get the people who come who are unconscious, prefers pour on the ground rather than raise his hand to throw in the bin. The municipality of Chang does in the collection, pre-collection and recovery by what you know household waste today is considered as new resource, by what is it resources that can produce a lot of money. That the controllers can take a look. The Isakam controller must be in the field because when they send the guys to work, all the workers who pick up the Bonamusa de Bin are the Benskinas, whose very Isakam controller is a Benskinas when he comes here which when it comes, it doesn't take an hour. There are some controllers I can name, if I see them, that take four hours to see how the guys work. And when the controllers are in the field, they take three hours. The trash can not dirty like that. Who's everywhere you see dirty garbage can is because they are not working in the field. The 
Agents in charge of urban waste management no longer systematically collect household waste in the cities, neighborhoods, and markets, and can do so weeks or even months before removing the garbage bins. Until it's overwhelmed, he doesn't approach. As long as the garbage doesn't overflow, as you see on the ground, as long as it doesn't overflow, they don't come to pick up. I think that the social service, the household was collection service in Douala inefficient. The actors, we know them. It is the urban community that is responsible for removing. It is Isakan which in charge, which is contracting of the urban community to remove, deposit in a landfill. But there is another service which has not just been added, the pre-collection which is also managed by the urban community, whereas the pre-collection was to be managed by the borrowed municipalities. Unfortunately, once again, the urban community of Douala, very greedy, has recovered this pre-collection there. The problem comes from the manager, those who run Isaka. Because not only that, our garbage bin does here four days a week we don't wear. Sometimes the workers don't come to work. So I don't know if there is a wage problem or not. According to me, personal observation, I noticed that they do not have any work equipment. Why? Because in the old days, the beans used to make clear every second it left. Every minute, we came to remove it. From which for some time, it goes from already two, three years that the city of Douala which the garbage can eat hurts. So right now, this is, is their refuge. The refuge where we put the beans is spoiled. Demographics in the city of Douala are constantly increasing. Nowadays, it produces more than 2,500 tons of garbage per year, which has a huge impact on garbage collection. We have already taken steps with the town, all also at the community level. They promise us that they will remove this. They have never reacted. Under these conditions, the company in charge of waste management must increase the facilities. The staff and the urban community of Douala must also launch an awareness campaign by displaying banners, inviting children and adults to fight against ins insalubrious conditions because it is habits and behaviors that must be changed from an early age. And it is well known that transform waste can be useful for the population. In Cameroon and mainly in the economic capital Douala, where urban disorder poses a major obstacle to the mobility of users. In some markets, it is really the jungle. It is everyone, it is everyone for himself, God for all. The pavement of Douala are taken over on a daily basis by poorly parked cars abandoned by garage and several bulky elements, such as showkeepers. In short, every does what they want on the public space. It's really very difficult, Douala. As here in Douala, we all know that here in Douala, it is a city really, there are many things where everyone does their trade. The roads are not respected. For example, here at the market, Makepe market right, now you see yourself that at the market you have no possibility of being able to move around because of the well barrels. Children who are at the market to fight, when really it's not possible to come to a market like this one, you find the flood, the lack of roads, the well barrels are packed a little everywhere. Why they sell in road when there is a space in the market? There is a space in the market, but nobody wants to come and sell because of which the roads are not made. They prefer to go out to come this side of the road, to get laid while the road is dangerous for them. So all we can hope for is to pray to the Lord when we go out in the morning, we go back to the path in good condition. Pedestrians for advancing are forced to walk on the roadway at the risk of being hit by vehicles or motorcycles at any time. This is the pain that makes us do this because of what we don't have or go. It is a high level that can give us. 
we understand that from them. If we build the market with our little money, we can go rent a small place in the market to sell on the contrary. The market is not good. We expect that this, if we can build the market and give us a small table, is even organize us so that there is a there is the apple sector and the coal sector like me i said coal it could well please me and also like the start of the school year if i don't sell like that on the way i can't pay my children pensions i have a lot of children in college at university a little bit from everywhere at the misoke market for example shopkeepers set up their wheelbarrows and tables to sell and the excuse is well now we manage instead of stealing to feed ourselves. We sell on the sidewalk just by what we don't have or go, by what we can't do otherwise. Inside the market, there is too much mute, too much mute, too much mute, too much mute. Even there, when you are down, especially in rainy season, so sit down so you don't see anyone there. There is stores only with has to look for a good market. He set us up that even if the counters, these little ones, how much anyone will bear that to run the risks like that. In case of emergency, it is impossible to travel for emergency assistance, ambulances, fire brigades. And don't you dare lecture his people who occupy the premise as a risk of being copiously insulted and even ending in a fight. If people are not active, responsible, and if the human community does not meet the expectations of the population, the fight against human disorder is likely to be a losing battle. Housing in Cameroon be is becoming more and more expensive, especially in the city of Douala, where the number of inhabitants is constantly increasing. For me, it's not easy because I searched for an apartment myself. It wasn't at all easy. I did months, three months to find an apartment to rent. And my daughter also wanted a room to rent. It wasn't at all easy. We had to pay the real estate agents who took the 5000 to show us only the room. And until then, when it doesn't interest you you have to give your money and keep looking for the room no matter where the room is located it hasn't been easy i think it's because we don't put the plate on anymore as we used to put the plate on now real estate has it already priced all the houses that is it is no longer easy to see a house when you arrive even on the same owner who at home sends you to the agency to find real estate. And when you come to him, he has these conditions. You have to give him a month's rent. You have his trip and so on. All of which is not easy. For me, I searched for three months before finding, and for my daughter, we searched for two months. A room after spending enough money on real estate, but in the end, we found without going to real estate, which was not easy. For apartment, if you are really looking for the modern three-bedroom apartment, frankly, you are told in the 300,000 CFA francs, while your cost is in the 150,000. You see the apartment, you are told the 300,000 and 250,000, and in addition, one year's rent plus two months deposit which is not easy when you go through the estate agent or you want some good things you have to prepare yourself most often landlords set rent prices based on the credit they have to repay to the bank their monthly income aspirations or the price of the neighboring house for me it's not at all easy to find accommodation in Douala, not really easy, because I had to look for a room more than two months. I had to look. It's not easy to find was really difficult. I look for, I went to the real estate agents. We give the money, we show you the room. There is problem no matter if you like the room or not. That's the downside. Your money goes. And the rooms that we show you, sometimes we show you the room here with the 
with the humidity inside everything and everything and everything who's when you even take the room you can get a disease the accommodation for me is expensive because i had to look for the rooms i was offered i saw a is super expensive a room because there are studio out there that we see 35,000 modern francs but the 60 room is not worth for me it i think is a real estate agent buy what may be when a real estate agent pass he see maybe a room to rent he leaves maybe to see the owner of this house he talks with the owner of this house all this when he already does he like that the owner of this house must already give him himself this part of the money and the owner of this house may ask you if the owner wants six months the owner will ask you seven months to give for the real estate money and he will still ask you two months deposit and visiting fees but there are more interesting the real estate agents who appear as a solution for any housing applicants but often turns into an avoidable complication because of the of his knowledge of the city he facilitates the search for housing for a remuneration that corresponds to 5,000 francs for the opening of the file and one month's rent. With us, it really became shut and the costs are very high. And then despite the fact that on the ground, the demand so much to lower. It is true that there is the English speaking problem with many population arriving recently. There is also population growth. It must be admitted that not very long ago, Douala was less than 2 million, 3 million inhabitants. Today we can count 5 million. There is the absence of social housing. That too, I must be said that the few houses we find on the ground now are excessively expensive. The landlords also benefit from it where everyone set their price as they wish on the other and he have decreed the absence as i can say that regulation the state does not intervene to try to set housing prices everyone set their price as they wish then i believe that this is also the basis for inflation in this field rents vary according to the number of rooms and the location in the city of douala for a room, a studio, an apartment, the price of the rent varies from 20,000 francs to 500,000 francs and even more for very high quality housing. The cost of housing is a topical issue. You know in reality, with the English speaking crisis, the population from Douala to double, triple, it is not easy right now, it's not this to find housing. It is no longer within the reach of all budgets, so there is a real problem in this sense. Generally, there are a direct sellers who take care of it here. Not only do you have to pay the commission, then once the commission is paid, you have to meet now. Isn't it the owner or the owner of the property whose price it really cost the skin? of the ass. A modern stone can go from 35,000 to 50 depending on the neighboring hoods. Now and now you need a deposit. It is really exorbitant. I think it is the government that is being called upon in this direction. There is a real estate crisis. I think the state and perhaps in partnership with the pri private sector must invest enough. It is not in this direction. Remember there is there is this expression in the jargon of the economy when the supply is small the price automatically rises so there is more demand on september 15 the 7 million 200 thousand tunisian voters will go to the polls to elect their future president of the republic the campaign was officially launched monday september 2nd 15 people die in the collapse of a building under construction in Bamako, Mali. Just over 50 people lived 
in the apartment of this building older constructions. African Mount it alone, the king of the Coupe de Calais, GJ Arafa, was buried Saturday, August 31st, after a very big vigil show at the Ufebwani Stadium. Ivory Coast and Africa in mourning our Reggie Arafat is no longer the legend of the Coupe de Cali, which died on August 12th of the month after a motorcycle accident at the age of 33. A funeral hosted by the Ivory State held at the Ufuet Buani Stadium, a funeral with great prompt and ceremony for the terrible child of Abidjan. A last symbol after the artist's 15 year career. Artists from the continent, such as the Congolese Kofi Olomide, Fali Ipupa, Daju, Nigerians Davido, Di Martins, Malayan Sidiki Diabate, Mokobe, the Nord of Cameroon, and many others sang all night long, multiplying tributes in front of a packed stadium. Tribute that ends until the early morning of Saturday after the exhibition of his remains where he has decorated as the order of merit of ever Ivorian culture. Then that will be taken to the cemetery of William City where he will be buried. After a warm-up between the police and the fans of the Daishikan as he called it her. Dozens of young guns will enter the cemetery and desecrate the body of the DJ Arafat to make sure that it's the idol who really died. This desecration, which is causing indignation and a lot of anger in Abidjan. <laughs> Very good evening to all of you. Goodbye.